OMG. Impressive. Gorge. That's hot. Trendy. Cute. What's she wearing? Hi guys, what's up? Welcome back to Clever Style. I brought on Clever Gossip Girl, aka <laughs> Clever News. Hey guys. Hi. And we are talking about Gossip Girl and what these gorgeous ladies are wearing all the time. So let's jump right in. Serena. I mean, she always looks like a million bucks. If, if I could raid any celebrity's closet, it would be Blake Lively's or Serena Vanderwoodson's because she does no wrong. I mean, in real life, the girl has the whole collection of Christian Louboutins, which is just actually ridiculous. Must be nice. And a shoe named after her, kind of major. Yeah. I mean, kind of a big <laughs> deal. But um, this outfit has no Christian Louboutin. This dress is by Lorena Sarbu. And I think this is a gorgeous dress. These are the Gossip Girl <laughs> experts, you guys. They know everything about it. So this was from a while back in the season, correct? Yes, but still season five. Yes, and I, I just think this dress is great. She's kind of winterized it, but I think that it's doable totally in the summer. 100%. I love that it's short. The hemline is nice and short on the thigh, but you still have the classy elegance of a long sleeve. And I think the attention to detail with the crocheting and the sequins, it just is perfect. The color matches her hair and her coloring so nicely. Do you love it? Yeah, I mean, she can take a glam dress, kind of like you said, you said, an elegant dress, and she dresses it down so effortlessly and makes it every day. And I think it takes a special kind of gal to be able to do that. So only, Blake Lively only Blake do that. Lively. Only Blake Lively. Only Serena. <laughs> but if you know the designers, maybe you can too. Right? Right? Exactly. <laughs> So um, her necklace is by Sequin, which I think is really cool. It's like this New York based designer and they've been in business for like 10 years and they just make like really unique statement pieces. Kind of pricey, but you know. When you're Serena Vanderwoodson, price is of no object, people, <laughs> right? okay? She looks incredible. I think I like that she kept the wrists minimal and the hair simple. I like the chunky statement necklace. I do too. All right, Serena, she kills it all the time. Always. Flawless. I mean, in her relationship, give us the 411, season six, go. You guys, season <laughs> six, we're, it's kind of like season one, going back to like Serena going out of town. As the producers have said, she's off the grid. So when she comes back, she's gonna have a lot of making up to do. She's fighting with Dan, she's fighting with Blair. So she's definitely in a spiral right now, which is gonna be kind of fun. It's the final season. It's gonna be 10 or 11 episodes long. Oh, but I can't believe it's the final season. The final season, but they've had a great run. They have had a great a run. Fantastic run. She's had some pretty epic outfits. Let's I mean, even look past epic. that yeah, this a is, second. I mean, they're gorgeous. This is a simple one that she did. Um, with this ombre jacket, which I think is so cool. I wish that it wasn't filming like so much into winter because it's hard for us to wear right now. But these things are on sale right now, you guys. So it's a great way to go get them now and wear them when the winter months start rolling around. So totally. I love this outfit. What about you guys? I like the green on her. I, I think feel. she looks amazing in green. Green is her color. Her eyes kind of makes them pop. I like it against her, the blonde locks. I like the gloves. I I'm not a glove person, but I like them on her. I think they look good on her. They look yeah. like they look classy. They don't look like edgy, I guess, if that's a way to put that. Yeah. I don't know. I like it a lot. But another thing I really like about this is the scarf. Now she's worn this scarf brand that I'm literally obsessed with, you guys. Theodore and Callum. Like I die for. I know, it. I heard you talking about them yes. the other day. I mean, I talk about it all the yeah. time. <laughs> Yuck. Like I'm literally obsessed. So she wore this earlier on in the episode. You all remember that like orange? feisty scarf kind of that she wore. Yes. Yeah. Okay, Incredible. that, that was designer? Theodore and Callum. Yeah. Amazing. I don't think this one is, but it's kind of the same concept of like those printed scarves mm -hmm. and oh, I just love them. I love how she, you can't really see her purse in the photo, but the purse is obviously mm -hmm. bright blue and it kind of pops with the accents on the scarf and oh, the whole thing together just works. I love it. Wouldn't you like to just sit down with the costume designer of Gossip Girl and just pick his or her brain? I mean, they probably have like the brain of, I don't know, like yeah. Christian Louboutin and um, like magnified I can't, times a million. I can't even <laughs> handle it. I mean, even this like khaki jacket they make look unbelievable. With that yes. also statement piece, the necklace. I feel like Gossip Girl is just a statement in and of itself. It it's is. True. I mean, they can take even the most simple of ideas, like a really standard trench coat, a camel colored trench coat, tie it in the waist, cinch it, match it with a brown bag, keeping it in that whole like brown earthy tones family. She's got the orange, really chunky sequin necklace. 
I mean, going back to what you said, who comes up with these brilliant ideas? This, this, this is a flawless look in yeah. my opinion. I would never go to a store, I can't I can't lie, you guys, and pick up a khaki jacket. I'd be like, uh... It wouldn't work on me. No. Me neither. It wouldn't, but after I saw this, I started looking at them and just seeing like what my options were for something springy. And I found one on Singer22, which is another great website I'm obsessed with. Yeah. You do Singer22. I love Singer22. It's amazing. Huge selection. Oh my god, and they ship really fast. <laughs> and yeah, and lots of sales too. Always, which is always a bonus. I mean, who doesn't like a sale? So yes. I found this like summery version of it, which is $93, which isn't bad for a jacket. No. You're gonna so, get so much usage out of this. You yeah. can dress it up, dress it down, wear it open, tied yeah. like Blair, amazing. Right. And yes. I like this little saddlebag that she has going on too. It's totally on trend mm -hmm. for any season. And that, I also found one at ASOS, 66 bucks for like a faux leather bag, not too shabby. Amazing. So oh, into that. Deidre and Katie always have the best clothes, you guys. I don't know if you watch no, Clever no. News. Yes, I'm serious. You take fashion, the true style expert. Yes. From everyone. No, I like steal oh. steal clothes from them. Can't lie. So. Well, it's it's mutual because I know I've definitely stolen <laughs> an item or two from this one. So. Well, I'd really like to steal from Blair, especially do this dress. Do you own that? Because I'll definitely raid your closet if you have that one. I mean, I, of course, I have an elegant Naeem Khan dress for because <laughs> my budget is totally on point with that. Just but, collecting dust in your closet. Absolutely, right. but you guys. Dress is unbelievable. It's breathtaking. Also, this scene was so. Ugh, for all the chair fans out there, no. <laughs> it was magic. The Chuck and the Blair fans. They. This is her saying, "I'm gonna fight for you, Chuck, in the season finale." And. Oh, but the dress really just made the scene. <laughs> Let's be honest. What did what did you think of this dress? Because it's a it's a bold choice. It is definitely a bold choice. I love the coloring. I love the orange. Orange is so on point right now. But I, I also love the gold detailing and that it's like a it's a jersey knit material, which Ooh. makes it a little bit more casual. And the racerback cut, I'm, I die for a racerback cut. I think it's the best cut on anyone. I think it's very very flattering. And the earring. Yeah, the blue. They're they're so fun. You wouldn't think to pair those with that dress, but I just love it. I and know. it works for her. Um, fun fact, I took a makeup <laughs> application course just for fun, and they teach you, the first thing they teach you is color theory, and there's six colors, and they teach you which colors directly bounce off of one another. My high school colors are blue and orange, and I found out well, that's like, why, yeah, exactly, I found out that's why it works. And so even noticing this picture, she's got the blue and gold earrings, and then she's got the orange dress, and I think that's why it pops so nicely, it's just that direct, opposite color theory that she has going on. It looks incredible. I think Flawless. it looks phenomenal. Yes. I would die for a dress like this. And obviously, like we said, that's not, my budget isn't sitting on a Naeem Khan dress, so. <laughs> someday. <laughs> someday, we hope. Uh, um, but I found one from Winter Kate, which is Nicole Richie's line, which, I mean, I'm like, I'm, on, I'm in obsessed mode right now. We've got Theodore and Callum Singer 22 and now Winter Kate. Yeah. But um, I found one at Planet Blue for $285. It's a long maxi orange dress, which is totally amazing. I mean, yeah. you can wear that all the time. You can dress it up, down, around and around. Yes. With summer coming up, barbecues, I'm sure you get a ton of use out of that. Oh, totally. So there's so many different looks from these girls. Is there any other ones that have totally like stood out to you guys or is it just their style as a, in general? I think every episode, I'm just in awe of like their the costuming and what they wear. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to think if there's any other dresses. I think what I like most about the show is that it doesn't matter if they're just doing casual errands on right. Fifth Avenue, so casual, <laughs> or if they're going to like a big ball or a big grand event. They just always find a way on this show to make fashion so effortlessly seamless. Pun intended. And, it, um, and I just think it's ever, all around, every character looks impeccable. The boys, let's give credit to the boys. This suit, oh, I mean, incredible, handsome. so dapper. In a past season, Blair and Serena, they were in Paris together. And those photos of them and all their outfit and their bags, I mean, a dream come true. They, they really can't do it yeah, any better, I no, don't think. There's no. not another show on television that has fashion of this caliber, I don't think. No, not true. since Sex and the City, in my opinion. No, but Carrie Diaries might give it a run my for opinion, its money. But it's set in the 80s, so it's gonna be more funky and fun, flamboyant attire, I yeah. think. 80s is so. back though. It's oh true. yeah, the I neon. Mean, yeah, I love the neon. I go for the neon. You do trend. love the neon. I do I love the neon. I love the pop of neon because yeah. I like neutrals, and so the neon gives me that color that I need. So, you know, hey, men to a little color, a little 80s, and yes. good television fashion. Well, 
Thank you guys so much for coming in. We really appreciate it. And you guys, if you haven't already gone to see Clever News, definitely do that immediately. Yay. Subscribe. Yeah. Please. Comment. <laughs> we always respond. <laughs> they do. They're the best. So thank you guys for watching Clever Style, and we'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye.